Welcome back guys, next gen RC here, and today I'll be doing my review of the Zaya Oko where I'm recording mic, and this is basically a $15 mic, but uh, prices do range up to $30, all depending on which color you choose. Um, white is usually the cheapest one, and it was the cheapest one in this case. Um, for a price of $15, it's, it's just good to go with the color, um, it does stand out. And um, the price isn't really worth it, fifteen dollars just to get a whole nother color. Um, all the prices and the the features are the same, so might as well go with white. And um, as you can see, it provides two uh, filters, which do make a big difference. Um, and the base that it comes with is uh, pretty sturdy; just two screws to take on and off. Um, when I got it, the box was really small, and I was actually surprised that um the mic actually came in there but it was all pretty snug and um it was able to fit all the wires come in a pretty um black bag as you can see in the box pretty simple small it was a small package and um overall it just comes with a usb plug um so you can charge it to a wall um i, I prefer that over a battery as you can see it it will It'll charge faster. Um, overall, the mic looks great, and it also brings a little aux cord, so you can plug that into your phone. Um, I had to use a dongle uh, on my phone so that I, I could actually hook it up to the XR. So if you have an iPhone 7 or up, you will need a dongle. And um, as you can see, the looks, they don't deceive for the price. And it's a pretty small mic compared to what I thought it would be. I also recorded this video on the mic 